Candace with Little Ladybug Patch uh, back again. Uh, so um, I'm just like so excited. Growing things makes me so excited, even though sometimes, all right, where's the camera? I can't see it. Okay. So it doesn't look like I'm looking over there or over there. Let's see. Okay. So anyways, um, I get so excited when things are growing. It's springtime. Whoop, 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 whoop. And one thing we learned is that sometimes you just have to start closer to the house and then work your way further away. Um, so that's what I've been doing. My husband kind of jumped ahead of me. We've already got a big garden growing. So I'm going to harvest some collards. But first, let me show you my inside garden in process. All right, so we've got some valerian here from one of my members of our food co-op. We use Azure Standard, got plenty of aloe, oh my goodness. We've got a sweet banana pepper from Spring Lake Family Farms. Got elderberry, I gotta figure out what to do about that. A stevia plant, gotta figure out what to do with, with that. Sweet basil from Azure. Those, so this is gonna be my edibles. I'm gonna also grow some lettuce. Um, so that we eat a lot of lettuce. And these are our non-edibles here. So, okay, all right, let me pause this and go outside to the... Okay, I'm back. All right, so it's a little bit messy on this deck. I gotta clean it up. But um, after a few tries, I finally got some stuff to grow. <laughs> these are the cucamelons here from Azure. This stuff is from Azure. Got some zucchini, whoop, whoop, whoop. Oh yeah, check out that view, dudes. Check that out, yo. I would love to have an outdoor kitchen right here along with more um, like a uh, kitchen garden, raised kitchen gardens. I've got some more growing there. And this is a great use for leaky boots. Faux show. And that's a uh, kale. And that's, I forgot what that was. I think it's cucumbers, not sure. Oh my goodness, look at those strawberries. These are like three-year-old strawberries from Azure. Tomato plant, more cucumbers, more zucchini, more strawberries. Oh, look at those pretty strawberries. Yo. Yeah. Hey, kitty, what's up? And here I think I've got zucchini and cucumbers. I most think mostly zucchini. Not sure what's gonna make it or not. All right, oh, we got sunflowers over here. Look at that. Little dwarf sunflowers. And that right there is some lettuce that just keeps growing back every year. It's red lettuce. It grows back each year and, and it bolted. So we'll just let it keep reseeding itself. We got peach trees and plum trees out there. That's a persimmon tree. All right, enough of that. I'm gonna head on up to the collards. All right. Hi, Jules. What's up, girl? And if y'all want to come along with me, you can see some of our other members of our family. Oh, we got elephant ears, elephant ears too, and elephant ears here too. And did you know you could eat elephant ears? I did not know that, but you can. Hey, Marie! Hi! What's up, girl? We inherited Marie from our father, my father-in-law who passed away. She's about 15 years old. No teeth, half blind, half deaf. But she's still going. We got plum tree over there, apple tree over there. All right. Woo! And way, way, I don't think you can see it. It's way out there somewhere. Oh, there it is. It's a pecan tree. It probably won't produce nuts in my lifetime. I really need myself a gator. That's Bridget and Peony. They usually stay out most of the day. And I gotta clean out their kennel. Um, put them in at night. This was, this is a remnant from our duck and chicken shelters we had. We hope to get into that soon. That was a duck, duck pool. All right, here we go. Hopefully this won't make you dizzy. I'm like so full of energy. See right now. Um, okay, I'm almost there. Oh yeah, let me switch it. Okay, so this is a garden I need to totally clean up. Absolutely, 100% totally. There was mint over there. And I'm not sure what these are. There used to be raspberries here, but 
I don't know if these are raspberries or blackberries, but they taking over. They're going crazy. I'd like to get the thornless, but because the previous owner did plant raspberries, so they might have just start coming back. And my asparagus, yeah. <laughs> my asparagus went to seed. I gotta redo my boat garden. Okay, hopefully there's no snake. I've already been bit once by a copperhead. See, this is my snake finger right there. Bit me right there. All right. Okay, here we are. This is what I call my husband's garden. <laughs> that was mine right there. I hadn't had time to do nothing. So we got a few things planted in the rows here, but I'm gonna harvest some collards today and check out those red potatoes. They looking good. Yeah, these are ready before we knew it. Here's another use for a laundry basket, and my laundry basket holder. So I'm gonna get busy cutting some collards. Just so excited for our garden going today. And uh, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to drop a line in the comments below. Alrighty, signing out of Little Ladybug Patch. See ya!